Hey everyone, Gabriel here, and in this uh, training video, I'm going to show you guys how to connect your REA Leads website to your Podio account. Okay, uh, so you are going to want to make sure that you're logged into your website, number one, and you're also going to want to make sure that you're logged into Zapier and into Podio. Okay, so I'm logged into all three, and what I'm going to need to do is uh, inside of the website on the back end, you're going to come over to Forms and you're going to go to Add ons. Okay, you're going to hover over Forms and go to Add ons. Okay, and then what you're going to do is you're going to scroll all the way to the very bottom and you're going to install the Zapier add-on. And then you're going to activate it. Okay, so now it's activated. What we're going to do now is we're going to go over to Zapier and we're going to go ahead and make a zap. Okay. And now what we're going to do is we're basically just going to connect the website to Podio. So what we're going to do is we're going to search for Gravity Forms. Okay, that's what um, that's what powers the forms inside of your website. If we're going to click on that. Um, we're going to leave it at New Form Submission. So we're going to hit Continue. And then this link right here, what we're going to do is we're going to copy it. And we're going to go back to our website. Okay, and we're going to go to Forms, Forms. Okay, and then what you're going to do is on your forms, you're going to go under settings. You're going to go to Zapier. Okay, so under settings, you're going to click on Zapier. This uh, cash offer is uh, going to be the one on the main website. And then the next step is always the second step um, that they go to after they fill out the first form. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and hit settings, Zapier. Okay, and then it should say you don't have any Zapier feeds. We're going to go ahead and create one or add new. And typically, I just like to name it Zap. And we're going to go ahead and paste that link in there. We're going to hit Save. Okay, and we're pretty much done with the website part of it. So we're going to go back to Zapier. We're going to hit Continue. We're going to test it. And it's going to say we found a test lead. Okay, um, so we're going to hit Continue. And now um, the, gra the gravity form is part of it set up. So now we're going to go over to the second step and we're going to search for Podio. Okay, we're going to click on Podio. We're going to select create item, continue. We're going to sign into Podio. And again, you want to make sure that you're logged in because now we're going to be able to hit grant access. Okay, and I'm going to hit continue. And then the organization we're going to choose is um, the, the organization, organization you have with your account, the workspace. You're going to choose which workspace you want to put it into. So I'm going to hit the top off for today. Application. I'm going to go into seller leads. Now, these may be different depending on how you set up your uh, Podio account. I uh, just want to make sure that you add it to the workspace and application that you want your leads to go into. Okay, and then now what we do is we just start plugging in the information. Okay, so for example, right here it says seller name. Um, we're going to pull it from the name right here. So we're going to pull in their name. This is what the person uh, filled in on the website form. Okay, the address we're going to pull in from, we'll show more, show more options. We'll pull in property address. Okay, uh, the phone, we're going to put phone number. And for, let's see here, email, we'll put email address. Okay. Now, again, um, you guys may have different options to choose from. So, like, for example, we can select, um, this is the setup that I have inside of this uh, test Podio account or demo account. Um, so, we can do, like, a new status and communication status. We can put needs reply. Again, um, the options that you choose will all uh, depend on how you have your Podio set up. But the main part of it is adding the seller's information into your Podio account. Okay. Um, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and click on continue. I'm going to hit test and continue. And now we're done editing. I'm going to turn, oh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and name this one. So we'll go ahead and website to Podio step one. We'll go ahead and turn Zap on. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go back over here. And um, that's how you connect your website. So the gravity, that form itself to Podio. Um, and what you would do for the rest of the forms is just follow along with the same steps. Okay. Uh, you would create a new Zap, create a new, or get a new link, uh, go over to each form under settings, Zapier, and then follow the same steps.